Hey y'all. Uh, so I'm getting ready to um, go and get a mommy makeover, a mini makeover. Um, gonna get my hair done. So long overdue. Haven't gotten it done in a while. So gonna get that done. Does anybody else feel the need to like do their makeup and stuff? <laughs> before they go because that's where I'm at like I definitely feel like I have to have a face that matches um my new look I guess you could say so I just kind of gave myself a mini treatment on my face um in the long overdue for a facial so then I have to schedule that as well. The kids are downstairs eating lunch. But I'm using Good Molecules, so I used their toner. And I just put on the high... I can't even... Like, I get so tongue twisted. Hyaluronic Acid Serum. So I'll let that do its thing. And yeah, but the curls are doing their thing. I haven't washed my hair since Monday. I've been in this routine of like working out. So um, I went to the gym. My goal for June was to work out um, three days a week. So I've done Monday and Wednesday. Um, probably going to do Friday depending on like what I do with the hair. Like I haven't decided how I want to style it or um, just what I want to do with it overall so once I figure that out then I'll be able to determine what I'm gonna do <laughs> and you guys are probably like what but I gotta get this to dry and then I'll put on my discoloration serum like I have more discoloration like on the chin line um it used to be like all over so it pretty much cleared up everything. I've been using Good Molecules now for about a year. So, uh, but I'm getting it. These are like little moles and freckles over here. But other than that, my face has cleared up very nicely and I'm super excited about it. The one thing that I love about my new workout routine like I already feel like I'm losing inches and I don't want to like speak too soon this is the Yerba Mate eye gel wake up eye gel I just put on underneath the eye but yeah the one thing about my workout routine like my knee my left knee has been acting up like it has been sore and just painful and since working out like it has totally like that pain has ceased so I praise God for that because your girl was struggling <laughs> for a minute just walking up and down the steps and just trying to get my life together it was just not not pretty um let some of this dry some more but then I'm gonna go in with the brightening serum and go from there but I will um, get myself together as far as what I'm going to do with my face um, and then I'll come back and chat a little bit more okay so I am officially on my way to get my hair done um, hopefully I'm not too late <laughs> I'm um, about 20 minutes away, um, so I am on my way to Rooted Hair Studio, and my stylist's name is Danielle, and I will show you all her new location. She actually moved, um, if you're in the Pittsburgh area, she moved from uh, Oakdale to Crafton, so I'm excited to see her new shop and everything that she's done with it. I've been following along um, with her, uh, I guess, renovation process um, 
on Instagram. So you can check her out at uh, Rooted Hair Studio on Instagram. And I will um, put her links or tags below. Um, I could also probably do the link in the description box. But uh, yeah, so let me get off here and um, I'll show you what it looks like in a minute. color in the car I'm not really sure because hold on yeah, you can see a little bit but I'm all done so I'm about to go home and show the kiddos so tune in to see their response Friday oh gosh anyway I'm sitting here trying to get some stuff done, um, ordering things, and just living life here. Um, it's Father's Day weekend this weekend, so um, hopefully I can find some gifts while we head out. I don't know why this computer is acting like this. Um, but. Yeah, that's all we're kind of doing today. Nothing major. So, hopefully, we can um, have some fun and you guys can tag along with us. So, we shall see what the day is going to hold for us. 